Na mkaribu tena kwenye taarifa za ya Nigeria ambapo tunakupasha taarifa kutoka maeneo mbalimbali ya taifa hili la Kenya. Na sasa hivi tukiangazia taarifa nyingine ni kwamba shirika la kitaifa la kutoa chanjo kwa wote Gavi limeidhinisha msaada wa dola milioni 155 ili kuwezesha utoaji wa chanjo ya kwanza kabisa dhidi ya malaria barani Afrika kulingana na wataalamu chanjo hii itasaidia kupunguza vifo vinavyotokana na malaria. Chanjo ya kwanza ya malaria ugonjwa unaoua zaidi ya watoto 2200 barani Afrika kila mwaka inatazamiwa kusambazwa baada ya zaidi ya miongo mitatu ya utafiti. Chanjo hii iliyotengenezwa na kampuni ya Glaxo Smith Klein na washirika wake imepata idhini ya kutumika kutoka kwa shirika la afya duniani WHO. We've many, had many stakeholders take part in this. Um, ranging from um, countries that have participated in the malaria vaccine implementation program, that is Kenya, Ghana, Malawi, countries that participated in the initial clinical trials, as well as a host of um, global and regional organizations, whether it's uh, Gavi or UNICEF or WHO or the Africa CDC that have all contributed towards uh bringing this process to this to this level Kulingana na daktari Rono imebainika kuwa chanjo hii ina uwezo wa kuzuia takriban visa vinne kati ya kumi vya maambukizi ya malaria miongoni mwa watoto Chanjo hii sasa itaweza kuwafikia watu wengi zaidi kupitia majaribio yaliyofanyika barani Afrika tangu mwaka 2019 The trial has been done in a couple of counties where malaria is endemic in uh, especially in the western part of Kenya um, and running through the existing um, expanded program of immunization that has been rolling out uh, other vaccines. Kulingana na kituo cha kudhibiti na kuzuia magonjwa kuna wastani wa visa vipya vya malaria milioni 3.5 na vifo 1010 kila mwaka. Wale wanaoishi magharibi mwa Kenya wana hatari kubwa zaidi ya kuambukizwa ugonjwa huo. Ingawa chanjo hiyo ina ufanisi wa 30% na inatolewa kwa dozi nne, wataalamu wanasema hii inaleta matumaini makubwa kwa mamilioni ya watoto na mama wajawazito barani Afrika. Malaria vaccine is and the, and the decision to have a malaria vaccine program is not just for the current malaria vaccine. Um, it's really for the current and future malaria vaccines, which um, are likely to even be more efficacious, have a bigger impact than the current one. So really, the, it's a long-term view in saying, okay, we've got to start with the most advanced malaria vaccine candidate, but we have a pipeline of malaria vaccine candidates that potential will be better. Na mpongeze kwa juhudi hizo za kukabili ugonjwa huo wa malaria na sasa tuangazie hili. Muungano wa kitaifa wa vijana sasa unamtaka msajili wa vyama vya kisiasa kufutilia mbali agizo la kuzuia wanasiasa kuania kama waniaji huru baada ya kushindwa kwenye uteuzi wa vyama. Viongozi hawa vijana wakilalamika kuwa agizo hilo litawazuilia vijana wengi kushiriki katika uchaguzi mkuu mwaka ujao kwa ni hawana uwezo wa kifedha kushinda tiketi za vyama vya kisiasa. Aidha vijana hao wamekashifu hatua ya IEBC kujiondoa kwenye kamati ya maandalizi ya uchaguzi wakisisitiza haja ya ushirikiano wa taasisi zote husika ili kuhakikisha uwepo wa uchaguzi huru na wa haki. If you are contesting and you have failed the nomination process then you are supposed to be given freedom to go to any other party or even become an independent candidate and contest. We want to say that that will alienate a lot of young people, it will alienate a lot of women, and it will alienate a lot of people from getting to, 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 to lead this country. As the youths in this country, we have come to the realization that we know what we want, despite us being in different political parties. Bukati cannot do the elections of this country alone. He needs the support from the Ministry of Interior because the police are the ones who are in charge of providing security. Our polling stations and tallying centers, some, some of them are public facilities, starting with hospitals, starting with the schools, and they need to be on board that. Na tukisalia na swala na lufungamana na vijana ni kwamba uongozo wa vijana wa chama cha ODM umewarai vijana zaidi kuania nyadhifa za uongozi ukiwahakikishia kuwa uteuzi wa chama hicho utakuwa huru na wa haki wakiwapokea vijana walio vihama vyama vingine vya kisiasa na kujiunga na ODM kiongozi wa vijana hao John Ketura ameua 